hello guys welcome to today's video by Charles stanley and this is a ts tech talk video so guys this is a follow-up video on the um limited content uh or probably content violation on the youtube creator channel so there was a content violation policy that i violated but i actually did not violate anything so um this was how it was displaying on my channel i made a video about this on the previous video i'm going to show you guys the video so I received this and then um, this is how it was looking like when I received before I reviewed. This is just a screenshot I took on the, those video. So I received all of these and was able to successfully appeal and it was restored. So I promised uh, my viewers that I'm going to make a video about this if I was um, approved or if it was resolved. And actually it was resolved. But the funny thing is that no message was sent to me. That's the reason why this video has been delayed. If not, I would have created the video as soon as I received the um, correction. But I never received any correction. So um, I delayed this video. And this is the exact video in case you are looking for it. Um, follow this video and see what I did on this video in order to know what you are going to do on yours. So after I did this on this particular video, um, I have to, I didn't know the exact period, but I think it's been, I created this video seven months ago, but um, I think it actually lasted for like three or four months and then I stopped seeing it. But because I was creating other tutorial video, I was not able to review um, the results to you guys. So let me show you guys how my um, Facebook Creator Studio is looking like right now. So um, I'm trying to enter the creator studio. Okay, this is the creator studio is loading up. Um, this is the creator studio and the internet is a bit slow. You notice right now, I do not have any of that just like I had on my previous video. And also if you had it, you might notice it will be displayed right there. And also when I click on the monetization area, I do not have the content violation. So, so many people were um, saying different things that um, it's because you are re-uploading the video, you are uploading on YouTube and all this stuff, but I didn't change anything from my content. All I did was um, did um, did the review, submitted a review, and then uh, did the write-up like on the previous video, and then they reviewed it. And you can notice if I click on the view page um, eligibility, and then go to that exact page, which is this one, TS Tech Talk, you notice it's looking good. And it wasn't looking this better when I had that issue. And also, if I click on this drop down and also click on the view criteria, there should be a content violation on top of this area, but it's no longer displaying right now. So um, I did nothing. I didn't make any change to my channel. All I did was I just kept uploading the same content I was uploading before. And initially, um, the message was that somebody was uploading my video and then they striked it. So many people were saying different things at random, trying to like get things to be. But I did nothing. I just kept uploading my video. And this is where we are right now. And the account is fixed and looking good. So um, I'm not yet eligible for monetization because... Um, I still have 30% of the engagement to reach. So once I reach this, I'm sure I'll be monetized. And guys, when I get monetized, I'm still going to notify you guys on this channel. So I didn't change anything on my channel. I still kept uploading the same content that I was doing on the previous, um, before I had that issue. So if you guys are having any issue, just go ahead and do the same thing I did on the previous video. And hopefully um, it fix it fixes everything for you guys. And if it did, please let me know on the comment section. But if you are still having issues with this, still let me know on the comment section. Um, because this is not actually an issue, especially when you are uploading content that you created by yourself. And then um, I watched a particular video tutorial where somebody said, um, we are actually receiving this issue. We are receiving this um, copyright um, content violation because we are re-uploading the video we uploaded on YouTube. But actually, I'm still uploading the videos I uploaded on YouTube because if you check my content area on my published video, I still had the same videos right there. 
I did not change my content. Every video I upload on my YouTube channel, I upload them right here on my Facebook page. So I don't change anything, but if you want, you can edit your video a little bit just to make it look professional. But because I'm the only one working on both my Facebook and my YouTube, it's going to be too stressful since I'm the only one working on them. So I don't change anything on them. I just re-upload the same thing on my YouTube and my Facebook. So anybody that is saying that the reason why uh, we are receiving the content violation was because we are uploading the same content on YouTube and on Facebook is actually wrong because I didn't change anything right here and this is my account looking good so if you're having any issues with your own just follow the step I did on my previous video and then you are good to go so I hope this video is helpful this is just how my channel is looking and it's still growing gradually so thank you guys for today's video I'm going to see you on my next video please stay safe and peace